this week on the Trend Out Loud podcast. Yo, girls are going to appreciate the fact that you're being honest with them. And that's what 95% of the issues are, is dudes are out here still lying to girls. Zion, my brother, what the hell are you doing, man? You out here lying to girls, man? It's 2023, man. We don't lie to girls no more, bro. You're worth $18 million. What's up? Basketball superstar Zion Williams. Like, yo, this guy got himself into a mess yesterday. So Zion and his girlfriend, I think she might be his fiance or whatever. Um, Zion and his girlfriend and, uh, had a pregnancy announcement yesterday. And it was all over the social media, all over the news, etc. And within a couple of hours, um, a porn star came out and said this. Exotic sex worker Maria Mills crashes Zion's baby announcement with some confessions of her own. It hasn't even been 24 hours since Zion announced that he was going to be a father when porn star Maria Mills exposes DMs from Zion claiming she might be pregnant too. Maria goes on to um, put out text messages from Zion, which is crazy. All right, this was Zion's mistake right here. Listen to this DM he sends um, uh, Maria. I don't have a girlfriend, but if I move you to New Orleans, would you be cool with be like my official, and then this black dot, I think it's the B word, just asking so I know how to go about the situation with respect. Bro. Why are you out here lying to girls, bro? Like, anyways, I'm, I'm going to get into the, the lying and, and what guys need to do uh, with girls because this is ridiculous. Um, she also tweeted out, I let you bleep in my mouth last week when we bleeped. You could have told me you had another girl pregnant. How was that going to work moving both of us to New Orleans? You think I wouldn't find out? All right. Oh, this is so messy. All right. Look, I, I, I wanted to do this podcast to, of course, yeah, cover Zion, the mess or whatever. Yeah, it's hilarious. People are making fun of him online. But, yo, guys, stop lying to girls, man. Like, it's 2023. Like, the the like that old school, like, oh, my gosh, I have two or three girls they don't know. Like, yo, women don't need to be lied to anymore, man. The secret is out, Okay. There are a lot of girls out here who are just as interested in having fun, just like how guys are interested in having fun. And so that's one thing. There's girls who are like, yo, I don't want to have a boyfriend right now either. I'm in school or I'm working. I'm working on my career. I want to go out. I want to have fun. I want to have sex. We don't have to have any strings attached. You just be upfront and honest with a girl. You'll be able to find girls like that. One. There's also other girls out here that are like, hey, you know what? I just appreciate your honesty. If you're not looking for that right now, maybe I'm not too sure I'm on the fence. I may want to have a relationship. I may not want, uh, or I may want to have a relationship. I may not want to. I don't mind dating somebody that's kind of on the fence and seeing where it goes. And I'm okay if there's no strings attached. You know, she might like you and she might like want to say like, okay, let's see where things go. And she might be okay. But the, the, if you start off a relationship and you start off like talking with a girl and you, and you're telling her all this crap, like, you know, like what every other guy is trying to tell her, oh, I, yeah, I like you. Oh, you're this. Oh my gosh. Yo, I don't have another girlfriend or whatever, blah, blah. You're just doing what every other guy is out there that's doing. And she's not believing you. And then you get into a mess like Zion, man. Yo. I am always super upfront with girls. I am super honest. I am single right now. I am not necessarily looking for a relationship or a long-term relationship. But if while I am dating and I'm out there, if I do meet a girl who I like and, and we do hook up or if we don't hook up or if we're just going out for drinks or doing whatever, and I so happen to meet a girl that I feel like is amazing, then sure, I would be open to having a relationship or, you know, one day getting engaged or married and having a family or whatever. But, yo, know, girls are going to appreciate the fact that you're being honest with them. And that's what 95% of the issues are, is dudes are out here still lying to girls and thinking that they need to roll up on girls. I don't have a girlfriend. Yeah, I'm looking for a relationship. You're my one and only. I really like you. Oh, I'm in love with you or whatever. When you know it's not true and you're just looking to smash. And that's What's causing all these problems? And then you're going to get into problems like 
Zion. And especially like at Zion's level, like, dude, come on. Like, how did you expect that that was going to go down? You thought you were going to make an announcement and then you're, you're going to be able to tell a porn star that you, that you don't have a girlfriend, but you're making an announcement. Like this makes no sense to me. Like I said, I'm just using Zion as an example to dudes out there. Just trust me. Your best course of action when meeting a girl is tell her your honest intention. Yo, I'm not looking for anything serious right now. Uh, I'm just looking to date. I'm just looking to have fun. Yo, maybe you're just looking to hook up. Just be honest with them and literally you're not going to have any problems. Now, if you're in a relationship and you haven't told your girl that you want to be with other girls, then you're screwed. You should start your relationship off by saying, hey, I really like you. It's I'm 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 down, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. I don't mind having a relationship, but yo, I'm young. I'm a basketball player. I have money. I want to still travel. I want to still have fun, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. I don't mind being with you, but you're gonna have to be okay with me being with a couple of girls on the side or whatever. And there's gonna be some girls that are down with that, and you would be um surprised of how many girls will be down with that if you're upfront and tell them honestly. And some girls are going to be like, cool, like you go ahead and do that. You know, I'm going to be with some other guys too. And you might have to be cool with that. Some girls are like, yo, I don't want to be with other guys. And you want to be with other girls. My point is that there's so many different types of relationships out there right now. There's polyamory. There's so many different things that are going on where I just feel like this, you know, old school mentality of like getting married or being in a relationship and having all these side chicks is just so dumb, man. Women are way more open-minded. Like I said, there's the dating, multiple girls, be honest. There's, hey, I just want to hook up. Or, yo, I really like you. I don't mind being in a relationship with you. But, yo, I'm Zion. Yo, I'm I'm a young, famous basketball player. I want to go out there and have some fun. Are you down with that? My point is, is that just be honest with girls. And I guarantee you, your life will be 10 times easier. You'll have a way better relationship. Some girls might not be down with what you want. Fine. It might cut the feel down from 10 girls to five, but those five girls, you're going to have a much better relationship with your life will be so much better. And trust me, you will never end up in a situation like Zion. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's your boy. Turn it out. Peace.